Well, here we are. After uh, many, many, many requests. After a five minutes... Well, I, we spent more than five minutes streaming Castlevania 1 on two players, one controller, but it only five minutes survived because of audio fuck-up. So there's been exactly five minutes of Castlevania on this stream. But... That's finally gonna change. I'm gonna play my first Castlevania game. I'm gonna play my very first ever Castlevania game. I'm gonna play the very best Castlevania game, the fan favorite, the one everybody loves. Kid Dracula. Oh, there's a continue. There's like, uh, this game has saves. Wait, how... Wait, what are these controls? I'm confused now. What are you talking about? It's a great game. It's the best game. I want to see what this game is. I think it was the only thing remastered on the collection, right? This is on Steam. This was the first time this game was ported. Oh, I can't jump on things. I can throw things. This kind of reminds me of uh, Tiny Toons Adventures, stylistically. I just, this, this guy, this little guy was a spirit in Smash, and I, I didn't know what, what this was. It's just a cute little platformer. Oh, okay. I do like this better than a lot of the platformers I've played on the NES. The NES, a lot of the games, especially early ones, were... Eh, they didn't hold up a whole lot. But, uh, what I was saying is the, the Steam Collection is the first time this game was localized to English. It had that, uh, it had the remake slash sequel on, uh, Game Boy, I believe. I'm not very good at this game. That said, other other than that, I gotta say this is this is kind of a uh, this is kind of a lazy Steam collection. There was no options menu. There was no anything. I had to. Uh, I I guessed that Alt Enter went to full screen mode, which it did. Otherwise. didn't have any video settings to change. It was nothing. Okay, they just take two hits. I, I thought they were invul inv invulnerable because of armor. I act. I would have played this as a kid. Had it, had it come to America, th this would have been one of the off-key non-Mario platformers that I played on the NES. There's there's more substance here than there is to a lot of NES games. But, I don't just want to play this. I want to expand my horizons. For reals this time. Don't 
mind me, just gotta set up the delay because consoles are weird. Wouldn't it be a funny April Fool's joke if someone actually got what they wanted? Well, there it is. It was $10 on the PSN store. I'm going to give it a shot. Don't expect a full playthrough, but I will, at the very least, I'll do a one-off. I'll give it a shot. Kid Dracula was on the Castlevania collection on Steam. And the signal's gone. There it goes. This is actually the first PS2 game that I've gotten on uh, PS3. The OG first release PS2s were able to... Or first release PS3s were backwards compatible. But not very well, I hear. I, I, I heard it was because the... The PS2 spins discs in the opposite direction. As monarchies weaken, local feudal lords grew in power. The first knights simply protected their lords' domains. However, the with the man. reforms of the late oh, 11th man. century, Southern for a knights second. became protectors how are, uh, how are audio levels? Did they valued game, courage not and honor. The game should be a little, a good bit quieter than me. Fighting heretics in God's name. But still audible. In this age, one company of knights was said to be invincible due to two men. Leon Belmont, there it is. the greatest that man who feared nothing Ayami whose Kojima. combat abilities were second to none. And Matthias Kronqvist, a genius tactician whose learning made him an exception in a largely illiterate society. They trusted each other completely, and they were bound by an old friendship. However, sorrow awaited Matthias upon his return from a victorious Mind campaign. me, just, wa just watching an intro, it was checking news levels. Of the sudden death of his beloved wife, Elisabetta. Matthias' grief was profound, and he became bedridden. A year has passed since then. Thanks to Leon's efforts, their company remains proudly undefeated. Don't mind other me, also watching well, an intro, checking a levels. A mysterious army of monsters suddenly appears in Leon's domain. The Crusades are raging in the east. And since the church is focusing on fighting heathens rather than monsters, it has forbidden unauthorized battles. Leon wants permission to sortie, but the church has no intention of granting it. One night, Matthias struggles from his sickbed and tells Leon that the appearance of the monsters is tied to a vampire who has a castle in the forest called Eternal Night, and that Leon's betrothed, Sarah, has been kidnapped and brought to the Hello, castle. Anvar. Leon realizes that he must renounce his title to rescue his beloved. So... The forest is swollen A lot of text. Not a lot of cutscenes. Lot, lots of 2D images. Provides a ray of hope. A great legend is about That's to begin. Though it's stylistic. Get ready for some Dave Wittenberg. That is Kakashi, right? Dave Wittenberg. Double check real quick, see what the options are. Uh, controller's fine, sounds fine. This is no no point setting it to surround since I'm recording immediately. Hut. Oh, that's not this. This controller's vibration is dead. Better leave that off. I th I think Crash Bandicoot killed it. What was the game? I think it was Crash Bandicoot that I tried 
PS3. I tried the PS3 controller. Oh, I want to start a new game. I just said new game. I tried using the PS3 controller for Crash 1, I believe, and there were issues with it vibrating uncontrollably. And I think it just, it killed this controller's rumble engine. No, I wanted to... I wanted to hit yes. Oh, the, so... Per save slot, there are multiple save files. Okay. Saves within saves. I know, it's funny, right, Jack? Good morning, by the way. You're up early. What just happened? I was gonna do this for uh, a couple hours. Strange. Ah, he must really like you. You won't be able to leave now. Huh. Who's Hello, there? Michael McConaughey. Now, Kakashi versus so the excited. Emperor. I'm just an old man. I just came to gawk at the man crazy enough to come here. So, I'm going to be recognizing some you voices. You don't seem like a monster. Here's a cutscene. <laughs> of course not. What well, is I your name? I hope your head feels better. Leon. I'm also Leon. still on a one second audio delay. So this is looking You're a little funny to me, but it should Leon look fine Belmont. to you guys. Just Leon Belmont. I have given up my title. And you, old man? Pardon me, Lord Belmont. Wittenberg doesn't my have name is a Rinaldo ton of range. He's not, he's not bad at what You can he does. call me Ganondorf. Leon. And I will call you Ronaldo. Don't call me Lord. We're equals now. As you wish. Now, please follow me to my cottage. I want Mark to talk to you. does everything. He's the Emperor of Britannia and Code Geass. He's the old cop and paranoid agent. What are some other big McConaughey roles? He is a Baragon in Bleach. Wait here a moment. There's something I want to give you. Ronaldo, can I ask you something? What is it? Why are you living in a place like this? Monkey King Enma in Naruto. I have as unfinished as business with Walter Bernhard, the master of this forest. Unfinished business? Not worth mentioning. I owe him. Well, I won't ask any more, but you're not in danger living so close to him? It seems eternal life is extremely boring. He enjoys playing at cat and mouse with the hunters that come here. No, of course the there's no way game. that he could ever lose. He thinks that um, how my are, uh, helping hunters how are the makes colors? the game more fun. PS2 and PS3 games there usually end up very dark through the Elgato for some but reason. What do you mean but by it, there being for no Castlevania? Way it's kind of he could lose. It's kind of appropriate. Vampires are loved by the night, and this forest is locked in eternal darkness. He has never been defeated. Well, that may be so, but I must go ahead and face him. When do Did I get to he fight Dio? Take someone precious? Yes, he abducted my betrothed. Oh, that's something How we did learned. You know that? It's Darren what he and I always does were looking when he starts up the game. Simon and Richter's you current came voice unarmed. actors. Your and, uh, astonishes me. What did we find out? Richter Belmont, I do have a weapon. David Vincent, Just is the English sword. narrator for JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, which is weirdly fitting gave up my and kind of in character for Richter. <laughs> Honest he would be the dude to get all hyped up I heard talking that many about dudes killing vampires. Here. If that's the case, getting weapons shouldn't be hard. Well, vampires, Take this with you. I guess, I guess vampires plural in the first monsters. couple seasons. What is this? A whip made with alchemy. It's stronger than any dead man's discarded sword. Alchemy? I'm not familiar with that word. Not surprising. The field experiments with the principles of God's creation of the world. The, the leather only person alchemist. who truly understands it is Matthias. 
You know Lord Kronkvist? I have known him longer than you have. His family has a book of secret arts, originally handed down orally. So what's our what's our lore, Darian? This is before he becomes oh, Dracula, knew. right? This is of Matthias pre-Dracula. Only a handful of people in this world know about it. There are some who consider alchemy to be heresy. Yep. Scar. I see. Ishbal. Ishbal. Are you one of them? Depends on which version you watch. No. If you are an acquaintance of Matthias, you are trustworthy. I will use this whip with oh, gratitude. Yes, of course. Anyone who knows Matthias is very trustworthy. Put your he left looks hand out. Like my left hand. He should be the final boss like in a fighting game. Like he should be fighting Heachi and Geese Howard. Don't move now. This old man. should do it. You can put it down now. What was that? The gauntlet is enchanted now. A spell? Some enemies' attacks release a special power. If you block them with the gauntlet, you can gather that power. What can I do oh, with the okay. gathered power? Very excited. You'll be able to use magical relics by releasing that power. I think Magical the only Wittenberg relics. roles I know are Kenpa- are Kenpa- right. Kakashi. Those and, who excel uh, in magic can use them. I have cast a spell Sora so that you can Dothak use them as well. Sion, I have some. Who was supposed you be to be able to obtain them in the a castle little kid. As well. I understand. I guess the character voice isn't necessarily the same as the player voice right in now, Dothak world. This is all I can do for you. It was fun. I liked Sora. Ronaldo, thank you. Wait a minute. I forgot to tell you something. The door leading to oh, his throne more. is guarded by five monsters. Also did so Kefka I will need to Final defeat Fantasy. them oh, first. That's, that's right. That's essentially the test you must pass to fight him. He could have done uh, Yuzuka. I told you before. If they so chose to cast to him, him, he has he has like a, I a that, tendency. But if you have troubles, come back to here be kind anytime. of. Uh, they won't be free, but I'll keep potions on hand for you. Whimsical assholes? Thank you. Is that a, that's I probably a good it. way to describe Wittenberg roles. Which, you know, fits Hisoka. I did, we found out one of the Belmonts was actually Hisoka. I, don't, I, th I think it was David Vincent? I think it was Richter? I don't remember for sure. Alright, so we got 3D movement. I have no idea what this game is. I haven't seen any footage or anything. I, I have flail whip. I have menus. And I have circle whip. It is very dark, and I'm reminded of Devil May Cry. Hopefully the castle has some lights about. Uh, where am I? I gotta jump. Where'd I jump to? I think I went backwards. Okay, I'm going. I'm going down now. Nice of Matthias to invite us over for dinner. Sarah, wait for me. I'm coming to save you. It's just Kakashi. He doesn't alter his voice. I guess it's his normal speaking voice, granted, but... Oh, that's the... 
The way it pans out, it makes it seem like that's the location. See, the camera keeps fucking with me, because I go up into the building, and now I'm coming down. I wanted to go up again, which would have taken me outside. Oh, that's right, good destroyables. A yeah, staple of the Castlevania franchise. No, back, exit, leave. It was one of the games that was still... Uh... PlayStation did a thing where generally... American games had the triangle as the back button, and then somewhere in the PS2 era, it migrated to circle being back. And this was before that. This is triangle is, is still cancel. And, uh, which is completely opposite the intended design in Japan where circle was meant to be the confirm and X was supposed to be the cancel. Just, I, I don't know of any games that ended up going like that. Okay, squares enter stuff. Very Devil May Cry, which I played through the first Devil May Cry. Okay, I, I wouldn't play it again. Hack and slash is not my thing. This is a safe point. Does the series have a... Does the Castlevania series have a different name in Japan? I think I had heard that. Tough class. Got a double jump. That sounds right, Onvar. Oh, no, that was outside. Which, in some way, that kind of reflects the way the SNES buttons were laid out. Except most games... This is the struggle between me and Jack in uh, whenever we have to bind controls. We always have our A and B buttons opposite for older games. Because all the all the Super NES games that I played, like the Donkey Kongs, the Super Mario World, the bottom button was... Okay, I gotta, I gotta kill five monsters, I guess. The bottom button was jump, the equivalent of A on the NES, and the left button was the equivalent of B on the NES. It was the run button in platformers. Oh, so that wasn't glass, that was bones? Big bony fingers. Trying to get jump, Leon. Oh, okay, thanks. We wouldn't have figured that out. Event item. Place a mark on the world map. Okay, is is that just for me, for self-reference, or is that actually useful for something? Dante didn't have a double jump, did he? Five bosses in each area. Okay. Uh, so, that thing I, I just got... ...is not showing up in items. Is it equip? No. Relics? Orbs. It, but it was round! It was an orb! Oh. Okay, that, that was a lot of stats. I thought that was the last door in here. Am I missing an area? Am I blind? This is where I came in. That was the front door. 
This went to the dead end bone hall. Yes. Y yes, I'm blind. This was the save area. It's a sweet lens flare effect. Cannot break. I have no items to use. There's, there's a tutorial room. This one? anywhere. Cannot... Wait, now I can't get off the table? Okay. I have to jump to walk off a ledge. I, I keep thinking the right stick is going to be a camera stick, and it's not. I can try to smash it? No. That's not anything. Wait, what is that? Oh, I can throw stuff. I always been able to throw stuff. Double jump up the ledge. That is very tight. Potion. What is, what is this, a coliseum? You having gladiator fights? Hooking the whip and swinging. I like swing physics. Swing physics are fun. Serum. Okay, I can whip pledges. Nonagon Infinity opens the door. Our triangle's heavy, that's right. These are tough skeletons. These are way tougher, tougher than the skeletons Simon fought. Moves quickly in the direction of the left analog stick to possibly avoid attacks. Okay, just if it works. Well, I'm doing it. Do I have to equip it? Oh no, I don't know what the guard button is. That's a wheel. Oh. Okay, that's it. I have unlocked... Flip. Flippy shit! here. Is this the previous room? I think this is the previous room. No? No, that's the moon from Majora's Mask. What, what, what are you doing here? Still not a camera stick. Nope. quite understanding how the whip grabs stuff yet. And 
I cannot double jump after a whip grab. I, mean, I, I think maybe I have to whip grab the ledge on the other side. Oh, there was another moon. I, I got a ticket to Willy Wonka's Chocolate Factory. You can accumulate MP if you guard against an enemy's special attack. MP will be consumed when using relics. Okay, so it's like a it's like a quick time almost thing. Relics like uh oh what what's it called in Japan when they do the Svarog. Hello, I am Svarog, coming to you from Svetlia, and I am here to stream the Castlevania game. Okay. I, I want to activate the relic, I want to do my cool thing. Guarding and I'm pressing circle and nothing's happening. Ow. So I need to counter before I can before he's vulnerable to attack. You're not going anywhere, Yasha Ape! I, I did not, in fact, notice that I had an MP bar. Uh... So this is the room I've been in before. I'm going to be getting very lost in this game. So that's where that was. Is, is the other bone room open now? What does he need all these rooms for? There's no one in here. Oh no, this was a save point. By the way, apparently, uh... Dracula just capturing women before he was even Dracula. So Vlad the Impaler is not a figure in Castlevania history. It's it's just it's this Matthias dude. A map of the House of Sacred Remains. Okay. Did I unlock the warp room? Are we gonna go to Turtle Woods? So what... How many 3D Castlevania games are there? I know there was Castlevania 64, which has mixed opinions, right? Some people like it, some people don't. I've read the Bram Stoker novel. 
I had a uh, gothic literature class in college. So I, I know more about that than I do about Castlevania. Still not a camera stick. I can do to kill something. Ow. I guess just a three hit combo. Millennium Eye. We found the Egypt room. And I'm not gonna jump on it, I'm just gonna hop next to it. Because Leon likes to hop. Loves hopping. Devil May Cry 1, I guess the only one I played, was uh, kind of that it did all take place in a single castle, a single building. Don't know how much that is the case for this. It looks like we've got magical warps that could lead to maybe other settings. So, somehow, I completely missed the Ganondorf organ before now. So, yeah, it's a lot of parallels to my experience of Devil May Cry 1. Zombies. Thrown up on the floor. Is there like, uh, there's not like a stale mechanic or anything, is there? Do I get punished for using the same sequence over and over? Count the time Zalrog hits the right stick, trying to move the camera. Camera angles are a part of what makes it so hard for me to navigate, I think. I, I'm basically wandering randomly. Which I think Devil May Cry had fixed camera angles. I, I mean, not fixed, but predetermined. I guess I guess it is. I get, no, it's not, it's not in one location. The camera is uh, moving in and out. But the angle is fixed. Oh, you can collect new techniques. Okay, I got a new combo. And everything exploded. Oh, that's not a that's not a technique, that's a bad guy. I think 
if someone made a really, like, really solid platforming, like, 2D platforming, like the classic Castlevanias, with heavy use of the whip swinging mechanics, because I like sw swinging, and better aerial control. That might be something I'd be curious about. The air control in uh, NES Castlevania games is infamous. So that wasn't a boss. That's not going to help me towards my boss quota. And there also does not appear to be a button in this room. Oh no, there's, there's stuff up here. There's more. There's cash. Even in this game, it, it's not... This isn't, like, uh, NES bad, for sure. But Leon cannot really change his air or direction. He can't change the way he's facing in the air very easily. Just jump into all those bats. No lasers. Cut it out. So are the new moves and unlockables, are those in predetermined points? Are they random drops? Or is there like a hidden XP system? This guy's never used a whip before now. Presumably. Unless whips are a standard issue in the army that he comes from. Ledges. I don't think there's going to be any buttons on ledges, probably. We got red skeletons. Like the comedian. We got Bemos. Zelda. Very annoying Bemos. Gotta die. Open the real time window. by lasers. Oh, 
that's what the ticket does. Yep. Game over. Is, is, is that him? Is that Mr. Dracula? I suggest using the magical ticket. Will, will I have to walk all the way back to the castle, or does it take me back to where I was when I used it? Oh, when's the last time I saved? A while ago. I do not remember which... I think I only ever found the one button. bum rush through the rooms. Now that I know the red skeletons don't die. <sighs> I was going this way, though. Because this door opened. Good old Bahamut. Bahamut. What's the... What's the Satan goat idol? Bahamut is a Final Fantasy thing. Right? What am I thinking of? Nope. No time for you. Is it only hearts that can be found in things? Oh, well, uh, got back. No, this is different. This is a different one. This isn't lost. This is before I got the four hit combo yet. Maybe that was the reward for this room. Back, you gotta press that switch. Baphomet, that was it. There was a switch? Is it maybe behind this door, you mean? That I didn't see last time? be like Mario. Why can't they be bright and yellow and obvious and different colored from everything else? I, I don't know where I missed it. This is where I came in. You're making my headache worse. You don't have to watch, Jack. have a map? I do? Where, where's the map? Oh. Select button is a map. Okay. I did, I did not know this. 
S. I'm, I'm gonna guess X is the switch. Well, I'm sorry, select isn't a button I often press. I gotta, I, I can't leave? Oh, there we go, okay. Map is helpful. I, I, I appreciate map. Wait, wasn't this? No, S is the entrance. S is where I was, where I came in. So is there any reason to fight enemies in this game? Do I get anything necessary from it? There's no grinding, no experience. Do I, I, I assume I probably need gold for something in the future. God damn it. Dubs the Castlevania anime. You know what studio that is? They focus on gray areas. There are gray areas? Oh, the like the dark gray ones. Okay. Powerhouse Studios. I, I don't know who that is. I guess not a lot of well-known voice actor names in that, then. Is Revenants? Ghost Warrior. That's the money collecting sound. This doesn't lead to any gray areas, so I guess I don't need to go this way. Hello, Cascadia. Thank you for the host. Apparently, Castlevania anime has a bunch of Lord of the Rings actors. Oh, okay, so it's one of those, uh... Put all the money into the big names so that people will watch because of the names. It's happening. Uh, I, I guess Cascadia has been waiting for Zelrogvania as well.
wait till next year when I say I'm gonna play another Castlevania game and I play a JoJo game instead. I'm doing okay. expected to. That's a lot of places I have to go. Go back to that room near the entrance. Uh, the, the, the hallway? Did, did I miss a switch? Why, why, why do I need to go back? camera. Can't see enemies down here. Zelda heart piece. I think I got him. The one you stepped on the first time. Uh, okay, which, which room was that? Top, top right room? I, I was told to go to the gray areas, so I went to the gray areas. not set up to have anyone on VC. It's kind of a headache with uh, console games. fight them every time I go through this room. It's not like once I beat them once, they're gone from that room. That'd be nice. I can never truly clear the castle of its monsters. Okay, here's here's a switch. They're, so they're in their own rooms. Trying to land on it. One day, there it goes. So should I just... Should I go to the gray areas, or should I just check every room? It, it, it seems like I should be checking every room. something in all the dead ends, otherwise there's no point to them. Right? It's like a secret alternate hallway to go down to the same place or something? But, uh, 
Zelda stall post. Like these rune spirit fellas. Yeah. Sora gets to the end of Hollow Bastion. He's ready to fight him. He's ready to fight those Disney villains. Take out Maleficent and save the world. And at the end is Dracula. Okay, so this is a big old, big old loop. Except I can't... Wait, is there not a door here? The map says there's a door here. Can I not access it? Oh, there it is. This is also just a hall. There's a room I missed up there. Maybe that could be a switch. Probably save. Who's the guy in Castlevania 64? Which, uh, which Belmont is that? Not a door. Nope, not fighting you. Don't care. Y'all can just keep on being skeletons. What's, uh, what's PlayStation doing these days with backwards compatibility? Because they have a lot of their stuff emulatable on PS3, PS4. Like, if you, uh, 
if you get a game, is it on your PSN forever, or do you have to rebuy the same, like, PS2 game on your PS3 and then again on your PS4? PS5 is just now testing how well PS4 games can play on it. But if... The earlier PlayStation games are just emulated, though, right? So that shouldn't... They just gotta put an emulator on the, on the console for those. Good fuck off combo. Back, back, I say. Oh, that's a red one. See, camera's not cooperating. Failed to guard in time. It's a long cooldown after you're attacking before you can guard. Lots of, uh, lots of multiple routes in this game. No! Enter! Leave! Bob and Weave. Oh, hello. Goblins? Flea man. Oh, there's multiple of these guys. I, I thought it was like a single dude. Based on the Smash spirit. It is the Frankenstein monster in this game? I guess not. I wanted to swap X and Y axes, but that's not... Uh, no thank you. No thank you, sir. I'm not interested in what you're selling. Which game is the Frankenstein monster in? Okay, I guess I'll just hang out up here. It's Floor Masters. It's Zelda Floor Masters. So there is two ways I could go. Probably want to go that way because that goes to a save point. I wish I could rotate the camera. That would be just lovely. So I can see the door I'm going to. I gotta smash more stuff. I need hearts. I didn't catch what year this game was. I'm gonna guess... 2003? 2002? So, what is that? 
2003, okay. Oh, that's, okay, so that's a sub-weapon thing. Want holy water? Or do I want the axes? The axes seem like good range weapon. Holy water is fairly OP. Okay, I'll try the holy water. I wish I could move faster. I I want like a let a link roll at the very least but I don't I don't get one in this game not yet anyway maze room I, I was standing there because I thought it was gonna be like a cutscene for a second oh nope still floor masters keep these things going at all times. Uh, there's a key? I need a yellow dragon key. Okay. Nope. No thank you, Mr. Dogs. Live in peace. guessing when the spike's gonna be there because I can't see with the camera. Another, oh yeah, I found a switch room. Now I just gotta jump on the switch, that's the final challenge. can't go that way. God damn it. Let me go that way. It's so close. repeatedly because the floor is hot potato. How many bugs and fish do you think Dracula has sold to Tom Nook in order to uh, expand his house to this size? a uh, successful guard since the tutorial boss. These rooms. How does this go anywhere? Ow! It does. Okay. So 
That's probably the way back to the rest of the castle. I need to get the other switch. switches. Switch number three. Just gotta get on. Final challenge. Save, and then I guess I keep going down into the gray rooms because there's still a lot of gray left. Guarding enemies the only way to get MP, or am I getting it from elsewhere? they give MP, but only from guarding, right? Like, when I if I kill them while they're glowing purple, do they drop MP? Understand that. I was asking if that's the only way to get MP or if there's another means besides guarding purple attacks. I like this guy, he's a nice MP. Says to invite us for Visago, eh, Luigi? I don't know, it sounds like an Italian food. The heathens in the east are more important than this.
What's the Iscariot organization doing? Are they around yet? Are they not worried because uh, Helsing is going to fight the monsters? Can Leon join them? How does Alucard fit into the uh, Castlevania fanon? canon? I guess by definition that can't work. No Alucard being Dracula and all. What is that? That was money. Uh, big empty room. I don't know if there's ever been a Helsing video games. The thought never crossed my mind before now. Because I got all the switches, so I shouldn't need to do much more wandering. Live in peace, my skeleton friends. A fourth switch? Did I not need to get all three of those previous ones? Would any three of the four have done? No, I know, uh, I know Castlevania Alucard is the son. In, uh, Helsing, Alucard is posited to actually be Dracula. Presumably under an alias. in which we talk about all things vampires. Or some other vampires. There was the guy who appeared barely at all in Code Geass. Who had, like, uh, he claimed to have, like, 50 different nicknames, one of which was the Vampire Britannia. He had almost no role, almost no role in the show. He was just there. Uh, should I not have done? I gotta do pla I gotta do swinging now. There's the bounce in Bleach. Oh, I like that take. As a different type of vampires, spirit vampires. Bounce were fun. Speaking of fun, this looks like it's going to be lots of fun. It's an interesting uh, swing mechanism. Go on that one? Why can't I go on that one? Did pressing the switch. I thought pressing the switch opened it. Oh, it's on a timer. Wow, that makes it more difficult. Cross good. 
is the cross trash. Biff. Oh, that's the basement entrance. Oh, that's where I'm going, I guess. Keep the holy one. I think next time I find some axes, I'll try those for a little bit, because I didn't never actually tried them. This needs the uh, the Crash Bandicoot running away from Boulder music in this hallway. That's my m biggest complaint, is not being able to move the camera. Which, that's just the kind of game it is. That's kind of what makes it not my kind of game, though. Not being able to move the camera, the platforming being an afterthought. And it all being in one castle. There are factors that... Uh, Keep it from be being a, uh, a Zelrog game. Ow. Ow. Ah! When's the last time I saved? I don't remember. I'm trying to get MP by guarding it, it's just not worth it. I'm better off just whacking them until they die. I'm better at that. Everything dead. Any hearts? Need hearts. You realize MP isn't for your sub weapons, isn't it? But I thought the wasn't that the whole tutorial? Is that I was supposed to guard the guy's attacks and then use circle to use MP? This is this dude is straight out of Dark Souls. I am cursed. What does that mean? I assume that's bad. Ow! Don't have to fight this guy, I guess. So let's not. Really use a save point soon. Oh, there's the knives again. What's it actually called? Knives? Knife, yeah. Uh, not getting any health in things. Fully expecting to die. Should I use the thing? Should I use the ticket? Am I going to be able to get back here, or do I have to walk all the way back here if I use the ticket? Ronaldo, I fucked up. Got potions. Okay, so I'm still gonna have to go back to the last save point. Well, what's the difference between that? I might as well have died then. I'm gonna go back to a mm. save point anyway. You've done well to come back. Is there anything you need? What would you like today? That 
that's 800. Got jewels for unknown reasons. I know, but if I'm gonna have to go back to the save room itself anyway, and not the room I was just in, what... Why wouldn't I just die? Because that, if I die, I go back to the save room. Is this okay? Is it like anything else? So I'm not automatically healed by being back here. I still have to, like, buy potions to get my health back. Dying resets your progress. Have, have I made any all? progress since the save room? Don't push yourself too hard. Thanks, Ronaldo. Welcome. What would you like? Is this okay? Would you like anything else? Is this fine? Yes, certainly. Anything else? What would you like today? Uh, per poison. Oh, there's poison in this all? game. I'm I appreciate about. your business. Is there? Is, can I go to like an inn? You got a bed, Ronaldo? Healing is expensive in this game. Well, I'm back in the save room. And how much progress did I make? I went down to the basement. I guess I would have had to fight the monsters again. I still might have to fight them. Who's playing the organ? Is that Dracula? You have a good time playing organ. while gaining MP and hearts. So that's if I do, like, a Smash Brothers guard. If I get it just... If I time it just right... You missed. Idiot. Ow. Hey, okay, so it is like Smash Brothers. You know what? No. You you can co we can coexist. Live in peace, Gauntlet Knight. This map never controls the way I expect it to. Feels like there's always there's a big separation in the way like this kind of game controls. Like, realistic atmospheric games like this and Devil May Cry and, uh, and, uh, Resident Evil versus, you know, cartoony platformers. They never have the... They never have the same buttons do the same things across the two. Like, each genre kind of has its own, uh, its own standard for where what how everything controls. 
money out of those. I, I guess I used up all my hearts. Alright. Back in the basement. Uh... Know my goal yet? I don't see any gray areas, so I guess I'll just wander. dollar out of every statue and I don't know where all the hearts went. There's a this is the three door, yeah this is the triple door. And the secret door, I guess, or is this the way I'm gonna have to go? So the 80 hearts, that's what that is. What I thought hearts were health. So I have to beat him before I can go in there. That's... Presumably one of the five bosses I have to beat for this level, or what it, however goes. But you can only heal through items like potions and food, so, so what do the hearts do then? Can't go in there, is there a dude in here? I guess this probably summons a demon or something, so let's do it. No? Oh, alright. Uh... Is this one of those things where I should have been paying attention in a previous room for the order of these guys? Looks like you'll fight the other guy and come back here. curse to? Is it imperative that I get rid of that? I kind of wish I had more of a ranged weapon right now. Okay, that worked. That did it. Probably help if I had the original game in like the manual or something. This was uh, before manuals were completely obsolete.
curse gets rid of your combos. Okay, <laughs> who needs combos? I, I'm a Ganondorf main. No one uses combos. Uh, this appears to be a bottomless pit with Dracula lasers. And, oh no, it's not bottomless. It is just a pit. And red skeletons. Interesting castle architecture. Oh, that's that's this floor breaks. This is uh kinda brutal without any way to heal. Ah, it keeps breaking away. Is this entire floor breakable? Is, is none of it safe? If none of it is safe. You can't jump on that floor. Oh. Okay. I just gotta leave and re-enter. I, I assumed I was supposed to jump over the laser because it is a laser aimed at the ground. Combos. I got holy water. Oh, so it gets rid of my advanced combos. I still have my basic, like, start of the game combos. Hello? This appears to be a flesh room within the interior of not Dracula's castle with flesh monsters attacking me out of the floor and a worms infestation this is twin this is twin mold i wish it would come out of the butthole so i could attack it Did that work i don't think that works Oh, wait, no, okay, I'm hitting that. I guess I'm doing good. Yeah, okay, that thing popped and died. Which I guess I'm supposed to do. Otherwise, I wouldn't be able to pop it, right? Subway weapons take up different amounts of hearts. The holy water takes up four per shot. Ow. And then lasers. Yeah. Then electric butthole. It's tough as heart. And the worm is still being a fire breathing worm. What, 
What is it being a parasite to? And it's and it's gone. Bit of waste of holy water. Very precious. Not a lot to go around. I'm taking a lot of hurt. And there's the worm. Think I'm gonna win this one. How low is its health? It's got another bar, right? Yeah, I, it's just one of the little dudes got me. Game. Well, at least we just saved. <laughs> Gotta be perfect run. Nuzlocke, Castlevania. New game every time you die. Orb enhances your sub weapon. Like all, all sub weapons, you get a, they all get a power up. Just like different orbs or different enhancements. Can I walk around you? Yeah. Live in peace, my brother. The fact that the worm is in frame at the start of the fight kind of makes it seem like he's the main thing you'd be fighting, but no, it's the eyeballs. I don't like these flesh zombies. Ah! Man, those take a lot of hits without holy water. combo uh, heavy hits. I haven't really been doing that. But I think this uh, against a stationary enemy works great. Ah, worm! Zora's Sapphire better be, better be fucking worth all this. Just stand near the lightning laser. Seems like a good idea. Fireworm. Please, no. I only really have time for one holy water before it moves, generally. That of the holy water forces it to move, one or the other. It's good damage. Holy water seems especially good for this particular boss because it is stationary. Ah, fire! I can't get away from it! He just swapped me. Swatted me. Leon! Leon! Snake? So if this is the end of the basement, this is probably all I'm going to do. I I'm guessing search ratio is your game completion. Like when it said five bosses, this is the first of the five. 
So there are five areas in the game before you confront the final boss. Let me get some more hearts. Hearts seem like a good thing to bring into this fight. I want lots and lots of hearts. 70. 72. Go in peace, my brother. This part of the game would have taken Jack an hour and a half, maybe two hours longer, because he cannot stop himself from fighting everything that fucking moves. Ah! Oh! Oh no, he's pissed that I didn't fight him last time! Oh, I took damage from that. Well, hmm. I guess I'll go in with full hearts and slightly less than full health. Ah, worm. Heart thing. Not time that right at all. Also got greedy with the holy water. get any warning or wind up from them. They just pop out of the ground and immediately it's a swat. Where are you now? Alright, down to the last health part. I got plenty of ammo left. Parasite from Dracula's castle, which seems like doing him a favor. I don't know why I quite did this, but I guess I need to, to break a seal or something. Is Dracula having us do his his house chores? Sorry, Matthias. Like, he, he didn't want to come deal with this thing growing in his basement. I got, I got the Zora Sapphire. I've unlocked the best waifu. And now I'm out here again. In this shack that looks like... I don't know, it should be in like, uh... Rust? What do you got to say for me? Michael McConaughey. Welcome back. Nothing. 
Okay, Come back there's a man in the shop. Uh, so I guess I would want to go into the castle and there's like a save point in the left wing. Okay, so Dr Dracula is not the dark god person yet. What, 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 what's it called? What's the, the role that Dracula holds? The title? Thank you, Menu. Very helpful. Yes. Cannot change equipment here. Open the real-time window. I have to... Okay, I gotta change my orbs in real time. And I have to use the D-pad to do it. Interesting menu system. Dark Lord, okay. It's just, uh, this is the tutorial. Where Dracula does his morning stretches. Wal Walter Dracula, my favorite Dracula. There was a cool Walter in, uh, in Helsing. Make it easier to pull it up with L1. Oh, that's, okay, that's, that's better. Definitely more convenient. There you go. That was your uh, that was your Castlevania. Pretty sure I won't be coming back to it. You, you, you're not gonna like this opinion. This is spicy. I think I like Kid Dracula more as a game. I think I'd be more likely to come back to that, you know, on stream. But bye bye PlayStation sound. That was it. That was my that was my Castlevania stream. I did it. It's done. And uh, ask Jack if you want more, because he'll probably be willing to do solo streams of them at some point. Maybe he attempted it once. Maybe he'll do it again. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys have a good rest of your day. And I'll see you later.